Today we're checking out Sonar X2 Producer, which is a digital audio workstation uh, for Windows. You can see that this is a free trial and I got this from Disc Makers. If you're interested in trying out Sonar, uh, you can go to the Disc Makers website and get your free trial as well. Or you can go to the Cakewalk website and get your free downloadable trial there. You don't have to get this DVD package. You can just download it right from their website and try it free for 30 days. So if you're familiar with some of my other videos, you'll know that I am a Pro Tools user. So why try Sonar? Well, I say why not try Sonar? I like to try new DAWs every now and then just to see how they work. Maybe they'll give you some new ideas on workflow enhancement. Maybe they'll give you some ideas on things you could request being added to your current DAW. You never know. It's always good to try out new things. Helps keep you sharp in your chosen field. So let's open this up, see what we got. And here we go, there's our, open it up, there's our DVD, 30 day free trial. So let's pop this in the computer and install Sonar X2 and let's just check it out. So we've put the Sonar DVD in, now here we are in Windows 8, we get this little pop up up here, we'll just click that. Now you should probably just hit run setup, but I want to see what else is included on the DVD. So here are some document files, it looks like there are some videos included as well so these videos that should make it easy to get up and running with sonar x2 so let's install this we'll just go to the install folder and we can double click on the setup file or i'm going to actually right click and choose run as administrator just click ok we'll just go through these menus i actually want to install the 64-bit version i want to try that one out and we'll just click install and now we'll just let this run all right so now sonar x2 is installed we can click finish here i'm actually going to close out so there's our shortcut on our desktop. I'm gonna go here to the Windows Start menu, and here's our shortcut on the Start menu. I'll just click that, and let's launch Sonar X2. So now Sonar wants to personalize user settings. All right, and now it wants to test the hardware. We'll go ahead and click Yes. Okay, so it has detected my 11 rack. That's good. And it's detecting my internal audio. Okay, so those are scanned, those work. Hit Close, and there's Sonar X2 producer so I have a 15 day trial here I have to register to get the other 15 days I'm gonna go ahead and do that registration now so I'll fill out these forms and be right back okay so I filled out the forms I'm gonna get my email and paste in my registration code okay so let's paste in that registration code now hit complete all right now it's been extended to the full 30 days okay and uh, let's just start a new project and check out this interface I'll just name it first run click OK so here is sonar x2 I gotta say my first impression that's a pretty cool looking interface this is what they're calling their skylight interface so this interface looks extremely customizable I really like the ability we have here to put windows in tabs wherever we want and still have them open and head instead of having to go into menus and open them we have all these tabs and we can get to them quickly so we can right click here and create a new track I really like the right click to create a track it's a nice feature let me just record some silence here to make sure everything's recording right just hit record on there having a count off and there we go all right, good, so it looks like everything is recording properly and that Sonar X2 producer is working on my system. We can move some parameters and then double click to send them back to their default. I really like that feature as well. Right click in here, we have all kinds of options. That's really nice. Drag in a fade, awesome. Have a bunch of different screen sets. We can choose the setup. We have a bunch of different setups really quickly at our fingertips. Here's our pro control panel. It's a compressor EQ here, very nice. So I'll open up a plugin here, comes right up real quick. Let's check out some of the file menus we have. All kind of options through this. Also, here's a really great feature, lyrics. Just type in something here real quick. I gotta say, it's a great idea for Sonar to include a lyric sheet right within the program. Cool. Change our font. See what else we have in the file menu. I have a sysx we can look at. Very interesting. We have a video in here. I don't have a video loaded right now, but it looks like we can do video. Really cool. And I really like having all these tabs. You can switch between them very easily. Open, close, whenever you want. It really seems like they put a lot of thought in how they could lay things out in a logical and intuitive way. So parameters and windows are easy to get to with just a mouse click. So go to discmakers.com or the Pickwalk website and get your own free trial and try it for yourself.